welcome to Limbs and Games, your one-stop shop for games and limbs. I'm Nick, signing on, and this is Skyward Sword on my new series called Hard Mode. So, uh, we're playing Hero Mode on Skyward Sword, as I said in the first episode. If you haven't watched that, you probably should. And uh, we are looking for my Loftwing, my red Loftwing. Despite all the hate that this game gets, I actually really enjoy it. Uh, the motion controls can be a little wonky. But when they're just right, you know, and you get the sword swinging in exactly the right way, it feels very natural. Um, another thing I like is the upgrade system, which they uh, didn't bring to Breath of the Wild, which made me a little sad. But they did bring the weapon degradation system, which I really liked. But this, but this game, it was moving in the right direction for me. It wasn't a perfect game, and it wasn't the best version that it could have been. But it was a step in the direction that led to the Breath of the Wild, and I appreciate that. Okay, well, I uh, just talked to her for no reason. I'm supposed to be looking in the plaza? Do I actually have to... Hi! I'm gonna play with my special friend today. Oh man, that's my favorite... Well, that's one of my favorite side quests. Oh wait, the plaza is this over here, right? Or is this whole place the plaza? Grus and his buddies. Here we go. Here we go, here we go. <sighs> I love this theme song. It's one of my favorite theme songs. Oh, Groose, can you please find it in your heart to let me win today, please? I'm only leaving this on because I want to listen. All right, I'm skipping it. Zelda shows up, saves your butt. You can look it up. Okay, so I'm going to go back to, I'm pretty sure, Pippet and Fledge will be in the courtyard over here. And Fledge will tell me that they hid the loft wing in place that I have to go get it. Yeah, here we go. All right, Pippin, tell me the good news. Tell me the news. Perfect timing. Because your loft wing has gone missing, so... I'm so sorry. Yeah, whatever. I really wanted to tell you, but if Groos... Blah, blah, blah. It sounds like Groos forced him to keep quiet about it. Go on. Tell him the truth. When I was cleaning the dining hall, they didn't notice I was there and started about... I tried to... But I... Oh! Would never be able to ride a bird ever again. That sounds a little rough. You know what I'm saying. I already know where to go. Yep. Yeah. Thanks. Okay. Gonna need a sword. Pretty sure I can take this. Pretty sure. Moderately sure that I can take this. You can't go anywhere with that sword without trying first. Yeah. You can't take swords outside of the spark hall. What do you think you're doing sneaking out with that? What? Your left wing is missing? You want to go look for me? Well, I guess I can make. I don't want to get into ton of trouble over this, so here's the deal. Make sure you get plenty of practice on the slugs first. Yeah, I'm actually gonna do this because it's been a little while. There we go. Got it. I got it. Got him. All right, cool. That is a move that is actually gonna be incredibly useful in this playthrough because you really need any advantage you can get over the monsters you're fighting in hard mode because they do take more damage and they have, they take more damage and they give more damage. I just wanna play. <laughs> I just wanna play. It's not letting me play. Oh, oh, okay. Didn't mean to dodge roll. So good, so good. I still haven't saved yet. I should have saved, I guess, after the first recording, because the first recording went well. <laughs> Shut up. Stop. Thanks. Yeah, uh-huh. Thanks. Thanks. So I'm a hard mode. Just, 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 just please. Thanks. Well, I've been a one-take wonder here. Cool. All right, so we're in the cave of wonder. That's an Aladdin reference. Ow. Whoa, they do a whole heart of damage. I gotta be really careful. Wow, the rupees in this game are enormous. Oh, jeez. But it's used to make all sorts of things. I have 27 of them, so maybe I already knew what they were, maybe. Yeah, they take two hits instead of just one in this game. Or do they take one hit once you've got the uh, newer weapon? We're gonna go through the cave. We're gonna get my loft wing back. We might do the race this episode. We'll see. This being hard mode, it's kind of hard to gauge. Ha, huh, kind of hard to gauge. It's a little difficult to gauge where I am before the recording goes up. I'm not sure how far how far along we are. Red rupee, 20 rupees, dope. Gotta run up this. Get over here, man. Get wrecked. Oh, oh, give me that. Oh, I can't grab them yet. Can't grab the bugs. Those are used for potion making, which I actually do use in this game. This is probably the only uh, the only Zelda game where I actually use the potions you make. Uh, I know there's a potion system that's pretty decent in Ocarina of Time, but I never really used it. I think I think the only time I really use potions and bottles is when like the games force you to, or in Wind Waker when you get Grandma Soup. Grandma Soup uh, has really cool effects, and every for every one 
it's worth two, basically. Like, you get two sips out of one uh, full bottle. So that's kind of worth, really. Let's just clear this place of monsters. Get some rupees, maybe. <sighs> okay, so that's why you uh, don't save, always. Uh, my recording suddenly stopped when my computer ran out of memory. I guess I should have seen that coming. Uh, we were looking for my loft wing. We got some help coming here. Uh, I don't remember how far into it we were, but once we find the loft wing, I think I'm going to end it there, and I'm going to clear some space on my computer, I guess. Huh. I think hearing voices that aren't there is called uh, schizophrenia there, Zelda. <gasps> <clears throat> Look, there he is. All right, so we're gonna clear up some space. No doubt about it. Yeah, well, here we go. Here comes probably an epic battle, right? To free the loft wing. To free the loft wing, gonna fight an epic battle with some rope. Fight epically against this rope. That crying noise is really annoying. All right, loft wing free. Oh, is it gonna make me do, uh... Okay, we'll finish the flight tutorial, and then uh, we'll call it. Here we go. Whee. Thank you, thank you. Okay, can I be done now? How do I be done? All right, let's go tell them the good news. But instead of telling them the good news, I'm actually going to probably end today's episode. So uh, this has been Limbs and Games, your one-stop shop for games and limbs. I'm Nick, signing off. And uh, this has been episode two of my first series on hard mode. Or my second. I don't know how this order is going to come out. Bye bye Oh, uh, what? Okay, maybe not bye bye because I suck at. Stop. No. no. Okay, maybe not bye bye because suddenly I'm still playing. So. <laughs> we're back. Still. Still here. Oh my gosh. Can I please? Can I please? Can I please? Shh. Please. I just want to end the episode. You know what, guys? I'm going to suffer through this for a bit longer. But for real. Bye bye. Hey guys, thanks again for watching. Don't forget to like if you liked it, dislike if you didn't, subscribe if you want more, and, of course, comment on how awful a player I am. Finally, if you've got some time to kill, you could always click here to watch another series on the channel, or you can click here once the next episode is uploaded. I'm Nick, signing off.